Stock number 17-222. This is a 2018 Irradiance Ultralight. Model 32BH. This is a bunkhouse model. Really nice bunkhouse. We'll take a look at that once we get inside. But on the outside, lighted power tongue jack. Easy on, easy off the camper. Twin 30-pound propane tanks with cover. Lippard made this frame for this particular model. It's not just a, um, you know, thrown on there, whatever they want to use. This is actually specifically designed for this particular model, which is really nice. A protective diamond plate up front. It's going to protect the front of your camper from any kind of road debris kick up from the tires of your tow vehicle. One piece front fiberglass cap with LED accents. You have stabilizer jacks in all four corners of the camper, giving you a solid foundation. And then you have a wonderful pass-through storage with some extra protection on the garage floor. It also, if you can see, has an LED strip in there. You can easily load or unload at nighttime. And there you have the aluminum frame underneath the front bedroom. Now, this is a fiberglass-sided camper with aluminum frame. It's got a power awning with outside marine-grade speakers, which are backlit blue. One key fits every single lock on here. You don't have to fumble around with multiple keys. This is also a true four season camper, so you can camp in the colder climates. It has an enclosed underbelly, heated holding tanks, which is force fed from the furnace. You also have thermal pane windows and a really cool outside kitchen here with a two burner suburban cooktop sink and drink fridge. Four by four bumper, which can house your sewer hose. It does come with a spare tire. Now the tires on here are nitrogen filled. What does that mean? It maintains steady pressure no matter what climate you happen to be camping in. Here's the working side with your sable cattle, uh, with your satellite and cable hookups. You have your 50 amp power uh, power cord. It comes with it. It's got two air conditioners. You can fill up your fresh water right there as well. DSI water heater. What does that mean? You don't have to come outside and light a pilot. It'll automatically do it for you. There you have easy access to your sewer. You can dump your black and your gray water holding tanks with no problems. And it does have a black water tank flush, so you have a very clean fresh wa uh, black water tank in between camping trips. You don't have to walk in and be overpowered by any kind of smells. Uh, city water connection. It has the uh, outside spray port, uh, fresh water. You can rinse your feet off, wash the dog, whatever you need to do. All right, let's take a look on the inside of this really cool bunkhouse floor plan. Awesome kitchen, hard surface countertops. It's got plenty of counter space for your toasters, your coffee pots. It does have a glass cooktop for your three burner uh, cooktop and oven, stainless steel appliances, including the microwave range hood, a Dometic refrigerator and freezer, runs off of gas or electricity, has a really nice um, entertainment center, you can throw a great big huge flat screen TV on there and uh, be able to have some enjoyment while you're out there camping. Uh, Radio Furion, it's CD, DVD, MP3, Bluetooth compatible. Here's the cool bunkhouse. And then the kids have their own private half bath in the rear so they don't have to track through the uh, camper and bother y'all. Uh, mirrored medicine cabinet. It's got a nice vanity storage below. It's got um, real good leg room for the commode area for the kids. Um, two ACs, thermostatically controlled. Cycles on and off just like your house would. Nice oversized bunk area with a nice window uh, to give the kids a little bit of uh, open feeling. And then you have a lower bunk here which also has a window as well. Another place for a television in the kids' room. I know the kids like to watch TV. You can throw a little gaming, uh, game console down there. They can be playing Wii or Xbox, whatever they need to do to be entertained. Uh, Trifold sofa sleeper. It's going to open up like a, like a normal bed would. And then you have a dinette table, which um, um, the booth, the table will actually, the tabletop drops down and rests on the platform to give you additional uh, sleeping area if you need it. So you can really sleep a small army. Um, in this particular camper, uh, it's awesome, it's lightweight, uh, offers you tons of storage, it's got a lot of really nice things going for it. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching the video, I'm sorry it's a little dark. Um, my name is Frank, this is Ocean Grove RV. Uh, we're located in St. Augustine, Florida on the corner of State Road 206 and U.S. Highway 1. Give me a call, set, set up an appointment, we'll uh, 
let you take a look at this in person. Now, I don't want to forget mom and dad's room, which I almost did, but it has a king size bed. You got his and her shirt closets on both sides, real wide open, nice windows on both sides. You also have um, uh, access from the bedroom into the bathroom, which is a ni nice feature. Mom and dad's room, of course, has a mirrored medicine cabinet. It has a vanity. It has storage just below. You got a glass wa walk-in shower right there with a skylight in case you need a little bit more headroom. And then there's plenty of storage for your hand towels, bath towels, and washcloths. Commode area, again, leg room. And um, you can access this from outside uh, the main living quarters, too. So, all right. Again, Frank from Ocean Grove RV, St. Augustine, Florida, corner of State Road 206, U.S. Highway 1. Call me. We're just two miles off the interstate here in, uh, here in uh, South Park, St. Augustine. Exit 305. All right, y'all. Thanks for watching.